what is going on guys uh today i'm out here at one of the local bridges here in pensacola i'm meeting one of my buddies out here uh jordan's with me we're about to unload the kayaks right now bring them all the way down here and then uh hopefully we're gonna go get on some of these sheep's head we got about four or five dozen fiddler crabs got some bird of prey sheep's head jigs now we just got to get the kayaks unloaded and get out here in this water i will see you guys when we get everything ready to rock and roll y'all check it out all right y'all we just sitting down another crowd this current starting to move now so we're finally starting to get some type of action it's been super slow up until about the last 10 15 minutes we've all started getting bites pretty day out here though pretty pretty day thanksgiving day we decided we we're gonna come fish for a little bit before we went and got fat huh there he is there he is boy let's go baby let's go baby good sheep good sheep good sheep let's go baby let's go baby get in here boy get in here oh get in here no you don't oh god almighty Get in here, boy. Woo -hoo -hoo! Let's go. Got that bird of prey sheep's head jig in the corner of the face, baby. They don't like that too much. They don't like that too much, boys. Golly, good sheep's head, though. Good sheep's head. Get this dang hook out of his face. Oh, quit, boy. Quit it, boy. All right, and jig is out. All right, guys, let's see if I can show you boys this thing without him freaking out. No, quit, quit, quit. Quit it, you little turd. All right, boys, there you go. Got a beautiful Pensacola, Florida sheep's head. Munch on that fiddler crab. Got the, uh, show you guys real quick. If you ain't using bird of prey, sheep's head jigs, you just ain't, you ain't fishing for these things right, boys. All right, boys, just got the first sheep's head in the boat. Uh, got me another fiddler crab loaded up on the bird of prey sheep's head jig, and uh, we're going to see if we can't get us another one. Now that this current's actually picked up, this she this bite has definitely took a turn for the good. Um, it was pretty much slack tied when we got here this morning, and Joe said around 9, 9, 15, this uh, current was going to start moving, and it did, and the sheep's head started biting almost as soon as that happened. So we're just popping pylons, man. That's how you catch these things. We... Oh, Lord, I'm about to choke to death over here. And guys, I'm, I want to go ahead and let you know, if you're going to be doing this type of stuff, this rod right here is a St. Croix Mojo Inshore 7.6 with a fast action tip. And this is probably one of the best sheep's head rods I own. Uh, it's not just four sheep's head. I use it inshore, all the offshore, whatever. Conflict 3000, 15 pound braid, 20 pound leader. And, uh, I mean, it gets the job done. Super good combo. Really for anything, not just sheep's head, but redfish, trout, flounder, you know, anything inshore, snapper. All that good stuff that you can possibly, possibly need. We got another one back here. Oh, 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 I just got bumped. I just got bumped. Get out of here, boy. Got us another sheep's head on. Oh my God, son. Oh my God, son. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, God almighty, that's a good one there. That's a better sheep. No, buddy. Oh, he's dodging the net. He's good. He's dodging the net till no. <laughs> Let's go, boys. Let's go. Got sheep's head number two, same exact pylon I caught the last one on, y'all. Same exact pylon. I do want to tell you guys something, though. If you're kayak fishing for the dudes, these dudes, you've got to be careful, man. Because they will ruin your day really quick. Dang, he smoked. Oh, quit. 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 Quit, buddy. I'm trying to get you undone if you chill out. Now chill out. Get this dang hook out your face. I know it doesn't feel good. God, you taste so good. I can't help it. Alrighty, boys. Got another nice...
Let's go, baby. That's two in the box. And a lot of times you don't have to necessarily drop right down on them pylons. You know, they could be out here swimming around too. So if you're not getting bit right on the pylons, you know, bring your bait out. Oh my God. Dude, that was a freaking giant sheep's head. Holy crap. That was a freaking monster, y'all. I don't know if y'all just saw that or not, but he literally about to shank this pole out of my hand. And sheep's head don't normally do that. They don't. That was definitely what we call a, a goat. A big old, big old fat nanny. Let's see if we can get back out here again. Oh God, all right boys. We're on another sheep's head. Oh God, holy crap, that's a nice one there. That is a nice one there, boys. Woo! Let's go, baby. Get in here, get in here, get in here, get in here, get in here. Get in here, you big boy. God almighty. Let's go, son. Catching jumbos, baby. Another healthy, healthy. This dude right here, if I'm not mistaken, looks like he had some extra jewelry in his face. Like he had broken somebody off before. And yeah, he does. Look, there's the hook right there. He done popped somebody off once. Get him out of this cat. Calm down a little bit. Oh, there goes the hook right there. Look at that, guys. Oh, chill my face. There. Y'all check this out, man. There's another. That's not my hook, either. There's another hook in his face. Poor guy. Woo! Let's go, baby. Hey, he broke somebody off. He's got a damn hook in his face. Look, you see the hook down in his mouth? Hold on, hold on. Alright. Yeah. You got Yep. Alright guys, so got four sheep in the cooler now. I'm only gonna keep five if I catch another one. Oh no, you didn't. There's something down there. Oh that ain't a sheep said though. There's something down there that's like grabbing my a lot, I don't know. But we got four sheep's head right now. Um, I'm only gonna keep one more, like I said. Jordan's got one or two, I can't remember. So, uh, here, not too long, we're gonna have to roll out, go start our Thanksgiving festivities. But I appreciate you guys watching this video. If you haven't already, go down below, hit that subscribe button, comment, let me know what you'd like, and, uh, while y'all do that, I'm going to try to get some more fish for you. There's a big sheep's head in here. I'm going to catch him with this crab. That's why I'm obviously using a big crab right now. Because if there's a big one down there, he's going to want that bigger bait. I will just hope to the Lord I can get him out of these things. Out of these pylons quick. Tracked nice and tight. Oh, no, you didn't. Sure did. Sitting there with it in his damn mouth. Just drop another one down there to him. Dang, that was a good one too, son. Run it through that leg and out of his back. <laughs> that sheep said ate that thing quick too, boy. So he's down there munching. I just had a big and eat that big crab I put down. Really? Boys, got him, got him. I knew he was down there hungry too. That might be a little better fish there, boys. Might be a little better fish there, y'all. Oh yeah, oh look at that tail, holy moly. Oh, thief. sheep's head thump, baby. The old sheep's head thump. Golly. A lot of times, guys, you can see I kind of use your arm as the drag when you have that real heavy drag. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Woo! 
another stud, boys. Another stud. Huh. No, I got one. Another stud, boys. Let's see if I can get him out of this mess. Get him out of this mess. Huh? No, that's, I haven't put it on yet. Look at that. Falls right out, baby. I'll tell you what. They've all been about the same size, though, but they're all solid keepers. Solid, solid keepers. Add him to the collection. Oh, God, that's a big one. That's a big one, dude. Oh, he came off. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God, dude. That was a giant, bro. That was a, that was a fucking huge sheep's head. That was a huge sheep's head. Holy crap. Get your net. Jordan got her a big old sheep's head. Good job, baby. Good job. That's good. Jordan got her a dang old sheepy, son. Heck yeah. Probably the same one that's been over there giving me a hassle. Stealing all my crabs. Mmm. Golly, that's awesome. Alright, let's see if we can get us one more. We're going to have to pack it up soon. Getting about time to go do our Thanksgiving festivities. Basically, go eat. But that's all right. I've had a good time. Caught a ton of fish. Like I said earlier, I appreciate y'all watching this video. Be sure to go down below and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Let's get to a thousand subscribers as soon as possible. And then uh, we're going to get back at it, boys. It's finally, finally time where the fishing's good. I might do a little bit more hunting, but it's going to be a while before I do that. And then it's just on and popping with fishing from here on out baby from here on out probably gonna y'all gonna see a ton of sheep's head this year i just feel it a ton of sheep's head probably some redfish who knows man who knows maybe some flounders Alrighty, guys well that is a wrap we are headed back to land right now um super fun down here i've actually never fished this bridge before but i will definitely be back um had two really really nice sheep's head get off it kind of broke my heart one of them was a giant like i saw him and he was huge he was probably seven eight pounds <clears throat> um but you know it's happened as part of fishing jordan got some joe caught some nick caught some everybody caught some fish today so nobody's going home empty-handed um but if you guys haven't already, be sure to like this video, comment, hit that subscribe button down below. We got to get to a thousand, man. I'm ready for it. Um, but until the next fishing adventure, I will see you guys then. Y'all keep coasting.